I'm here at St James in Moss Side to explain why we are asking the people of our four congregations to make a financial gift uh, for our extension project. This is part of our shared vision, uh, life and hope for all. You would have been given or have been sent uh, by email a, a leaflet to explain the details, but I thought it'd be helpful if you saw for yourself what we're planning to do and why we think this is a good idea. So enough from the rector, and now let's meet this handsome fella. Well, actually, it's just me. Well, here we are at the building site. Uh, we've been able to afford to start the work, uh, but unfortunately not complete it due to uh, rising costs of building materials. So we're going to build a basic shell, which will be weatherproof and secure. Uh, but we need to raise more money. We need to raise just over £180,000 to complete the whole project. But I'll come back to that. Uh, first, let's just look at uh, this lively corner of Moss Side. This is the junction of uh, Prince's Parkway and Great Western Street. Two very, very busy roads. And although today's a Saturday, so it's not as busy as it would be midweek. But even so, this is very much the centre of a busy community. So I'm standing at the front of St James, just near the front door. And I'm looking over Princess Parkway to Quinney Crescent. And behind that, the Alexandra Road or Alexandra Park Estate. It's a huge estate for people of Moss Side. On the other side of Moss Side, there are rows and rows of terrace housing. that are recently refurbished. St James is at the centre of very significant redevelopment. This is the former Moscare headquarters building, office building, which has now been renovated to include 17 starter flats for people who have never owned a home before and never rented a home. And uh, these people, these young people, are largely people who have had difficult backgrounds. And this is just a few yards from St James. And on the other side of St James, on Princess Parkway, is a huge development. 103 two-bedroom apartments for mostly young adults, right next door to our church. And on the edge of St James's Parish, but still only a few minutes walk away from church, is this development. The depot is a massive development. It's a great opportunity for mission from St James. We want St James to be a part of that regeneration. The building is at the heart of all this new hope and vision. And vision is what we're about as Christians. This is our vision as church, life and hope for all. This extension project will be a community hub for the people of Moss Side. So this is Belay. he leads Manchester Refugee Support Network and he's very much looking forward to the work being completed. Belay, will you have to just say what difference it will make to your work? Yeah, so it will make difference. It will help us to increase our service to refugees and the local communities. And we will have also a community cafe that will serve the local community and other people to come together and to have make friendship. Uh, it will also help people to bring people together. The community hub at the centre of Moss Side will be an amazing facility, transformative for church and community, I, I believe. There's no cafe in this area open to all people, whatever their background. And this is our aim, to draw in people from Moss Side in all its wonderful diversity. This is a Christian missionary initiative that is worth supporting. And so we ask you to pray and give generously during this month of March. A verse from 1 Chronicles. Now, our God, we give you thanks and praise your glorious name. But who am I and who are my people that we should be able to give as generously as this? Everything comes from you and we have given you only what comes from your hand. Thank you.